All right, this one's all you because I have no idea about any of this stuff. Can I have my, ener- my energy drink. <laughs> my energy drink. Can I have some of the energy God. drink? <laughs> what's hers is hers, and what's mine is hers. Thank you. Dutch Bros. From Morgan. <clears throat> okay. Can you still do the intro? Because I'm just so awkward about it. And What do we do first? Oh, a photo. You do the intro. No, I am not good at it. And it's so painful to watch. Like, But it's your video. I actually never watch our videos. I've only watched like four of them. That's not true. I haven't watched very many. I feel like four is a very low Five, number. Five, ten? No. <sighs> what do you think? I don't sit around watching our videos. Actually, neither do I. I edit them and I don't think I've ever rewatched one. Yeah. Um, okay. Um, Mostly because so, I don't want to see the comments, to be honest. You can't see the comments if you watch the video. You have mm-hmm. to actually look down for the comments. Well, I will if I'm there. No. Well, <clears throat> go for it, babe. Give them the intro. They know who we are. Can we just... Nope, give them the intro. Because this is a new product, so new people might be coming to the channel because of this. Hello, everybody. Welcome back to Box Pop and Beauty. I'm Kendall. I'm Michael. He made me do that. Um, today, <clears throat> yeah, like he can make me do anything, exactly. but you know what I mean. Um, today we're opening my, <laughs> today we're opening Mighty Nest. This is a new subscription that I started. Didn't, st- okay. I didn't start it. I started buying it for myself. This is a train wreck. Oh my God. This is a disaster. Um, anyway, it is a, um, subscription that's like based on green products you know things that are like good for the environment so they try to kind of replace things you're already readily using with things that are a little bit better for the planet it's really affordable it's 11 dollars a month and i used a code it was try fix three i think you could put that on your thingy here if you want maybe we should look and see if you get like a referral code that we can give them no i don't are you positive? Yeah, I just looked at all this stuff. I'll check. <laughs> anyway, I used... Link tri- will be down below. I used this code, TRIFIX3, and I only paid $3 for my first envelope. Is that $3 shipped or $3 plus shipping? Shipped. And is that $11 shipped or $11 plus shipping? Shipped. Wow. Yep. Um, and I have no clue what's in here, but they also have like a shop on their website. So they'll send emails where you can buy like additional stuff if you want to and you can go on their shop i'm pretty sure and just buy stuff like uh mighty nest is where i got the avocado sock oh very cute um yeah so let's do it shall we never mind you would never know i'm a public speaker for a living no you wouldn't oh my okay Welcome. Uh, basically what I said. (laughs) (laughs) Okay, leaf bags, I guess. What? Are they like little sandwich bags? They're like little reusable. Oh, feel the inside. They're like wipeable. they're plastic. So, high quality bags resist grease and moisture and last for years. 100% 100% cotton exterior with waterproof liner to keep food fresh longer. Easy and secure Velcro closure. Lead. What is it called? Huh? The what? Velcro. <laughs> Lead filthylate and BPA free. Woman founded and family operated company. That's pretty cool. And by the way, this card is printed on 100% Post-consumer waste recycled paper. So I would say this is like um, your sandwich size Ziploc and this is your snack size Ziploc. Don't say Ziploc is a whole other company. I'm giving them a comparison. Ziploc is like, Ziploc is like Kleenex. Like nobody says tissue anymore. They say Kleenex. That's when you know you really have the monopoly on the market. So this is sandwich size. This is snack size. That's what appears. So this was the first one. So I paid $3 for these. Not bad. Yeah. All right, let's see what's in the second box. This is our second month here. So these are our first two months. This is month number two. Poor Kendall has been waiting because she, like, insisted on doing a video for these. 
so she didn't want to open it. All right. Oh. Nice. Nice. We already have some of these, but I never mind having more because somehow these disappear. So we paid eleven dollars. That's not bad for these. So we got the dryer balls. Uh, the dryer synthetic balls. dry. Uh, goodbye, synthetic dryer sheets. Um, this month we replaced dryer sheets with reusable dryer balls made of one hundred percent natural New Zealand wool. Dryer balls soften clothes and shorten drying time and reduce static without exposing your family to toxic chemicals. Just toss them in and tumble for thousands of loads. Every time you use dryer balls instead of static dryer sheets, you'll protect your family from polluted indoor air and help reduce landfill waste. What are, there's like statistics on the side. Did you know? Oh, did you know standard scented dryer sheets emit up to eight hazardous air pollutants? Crazy. Didn't know that. I was looking at this uh, thing online today that was like how long it takes different things to um, go away, like once they go into a landfill. And, like, paper product was, like, I don't remember, two years or something. Um, diapers were 450 years. Diapers take forever. <laughs> the thing that was the longest was uh, plastic water bottles, and those were, like, a 1,000 years. Wow. So, um, yeah, I just feel like, you know, of all the subscriptions that you can get, this is something where they replace something that you're going to use anyway. Like, you're going to put something in your dryer, most likely. And if you're not, this is so easy to do. They replace stuff that you are already using, and they give you a very easy way to make it a little bit more green. So here's my question. <clears throat> the average Joe question. So they send out these dryer balls, and you're somebody who has a box of dryer. You just went to Costco, and you got a box of dryer sheets from Costco. What do you do? Do you throw them out? Do you uh, use them still and then... When you're done with them, you just don't buy more. What do you do? I think, well, for me personally, like the kind of person that I am, obviously throwing them away does not solve the problem. I think that they should be used because if they're going to get in the garbage anyway, you might as well use them. Um, I would probably donate mine to somebody who can't afford things like this and can't afford dryer sheets and stuff. And I would just start using this. Or you could just... So, Use the rest of what you have. But the cool thing... Let that, the people who can't afford it pollute their own lungs. I. That is, this is why I think The Purge is the most realistic so horror stupid. movie out there. It's what you, you, you quoted. You just said it. They can't afford the dryer sheets. Give it to them. Let them pollute their own lungs. Well, the other option would be to keep your dryer sheets, donate these, and order another set of these off their website for yourself. Um, but the cool thing I want to say about this and the reason that I started doing this in the first place was that we really want to be more green. We talk about that a lot. And this is a way to like implement one thing every month. So you're like, you're slowly doing it yeah. versus like feeling overwhelmed of all the things that you're doing that are not very green. Makes sense. So yeah, I'm happy with it. I think it's really cool. I think I'm just giving her shit, but I think it's really cool. Um, yeah, go check them out. We'll leave a link down below in the description, and we'll see you guys in the next video. Bye. Thanks for watching, everybody. Make sure you like, subscribe, and hit that notification bell. See you next time. Bye-bye.